It's the Andy Griffith Show, Facts and Trivia, with your host, Bob Snap. Hi guys, welcome to the Andy Griffith Show, Facts and Trivia, appreciate you being here. Um, today's video is on, have you ever thought about... Uh, Andy Griffith show was in the 60s and there was so much going on then like uh, the assassination of JFK, okay, um, civil rights movement, Vietnam War, and none of it ever faced Mayberry. Did you ever wonder why? Me too. Let's take a look. During the Andy Griffith show eight year run on CBS from 60 to 68, the U.S. endured a traumatizing st uh, stretch in its history. Assassination of President John F. Kennedy in 63, the Civil Rights Movement, and the Vietnam War changed the nation forever, yet the town of Mayberry carried on, seemingly ignorant to the events that had happened in the world. Now here's how the comedy about uh, life in small North Carolina town endured through the cultural change that rocked the rest of the planet. An illustrated world unto itself, Mayberry seemed too good to be true. Uh, mostly obedient children contented townspeople, the occasional band concert, and all the pie you could ever want. The uneventful professional lives of the town's law enforcement officers were a testament to peaceful Mayberry, but there was not even a whiff of the change in the air happening to the rest of the nation. There's something iconic, uh, something quintessential American about the Andy Griffith Show, device author of uh, Andy and Don, The Making of a Friendship and Classic American TV Show, wrote. Uh, the program appeared at a moment of dramatic flux in American society. The show by design wasn't meant to take on cultural upheaval of the day. It was a time of assassinations, electrified music, and slackening standards on sex and drugs, he continued. Yet the Griffith Show refused to embrace those changes or even to acknowledge them. Instead, the program trained its gaze uh, backward, revisiting and reviving the rural Americana of the 1930s, the time of Andy's childhood in North Carolina and Don Knotts in West Virginia. That's that. Um, I think it was very wise of them. It's comedy, after all. Uh, and if you touch on such serious topics, that's going to just run, take the whole uh, magic from Mayberry. Uh, what do you think? That's all I got for you. Don't forget classic sitcoms, facts, and trivia. Um, today's a good one. Someone asked for Bonanza, and I got some stuff on Bonanza, so uh, check it out. Uh, link is in the description below if you don't know how to get there. And once you are there, please subscribe. Have a great day. God bless you. And from the Philippines. Thank you.